Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to our second episode of Surviving Mars. So if you guys missed the first episode, this is a game about building a colony on Mars. Uh, the first video was sponsored. This one is not, but it is a continuing series. So make sure I wanted you guys to know that uh, right up front. Um, as it is, they're still supporting the series. Uh, as we continue on today, we got a lot of our base necessities down. We got our water and our oxygen production in there. We do have a couple good positions here to build up our, our first dome. Now we do have rare earth metals over on this side. Uh, and the rare earth metals are kind of nice to grab. So I'm going to do that. We're going to bring back our RC transport. And we'll put him to unload all of his loot over here. Unload onto that. Now what we need to do... Okay, nope, I don't want you to do that. Shoot. Right click. Okay, nope. Right click. Nope. See, there's some sort of... Sort of I wish it was right click you do that. And we'll just escape out of it. Okay, we got a lot of power happening. Uh, we are fully powered up. Our sterling generators are working. What we're going to do next is we're going to build up a, a dome. We're going to put that dome right over here. Now the dome, what we want is this thing, which is rare earth metals. And the rare earth metals require, if I show you here. Oh, nice. We got another sector scanned. Uh, let's click on this. Um, it shows it requires 12 workers, four per shift. So we're going to have to put that on. We could put that right over here somewhere. So it's on that little uh, money sign. We'll do that right there. Hey, oh, too far from domes. I have to build the dome first. Okay, the basic dome. So we have to have that dome, uh, the hexagon outside the dome has to include where our um, rare earth metal machine will be. So we'll put it right here. That looks like a really, really pretty spot for it, doesn't it? We'll be able to see our stuff over on that side. Uh, the other problem that we're gonna have is that this is outside of our dome, or outside of our drone hub. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring over this rover. Red Rover, Red Rover, bring the Rover right over. It's gonna bring in its four additional drones and they will start working on it. Now it's gonna take a lot of metals and a lot of supplies. You can see it takes 80 concrete, 20 metals and 10 polymer. Ooh. Okay, wait, I want you to stay like right here. Ah, see it's outside of all range, but we'll, we'll be able to collect some metals. If you come over to here, we'll have some metals and you can grab that. Shoot, well, let's come up here then because there's metal right over here that you can bring in. And we can also bring in this guy and we can have you load up on concrete. We'll have you load up on concrete. There you go. We do have a, a malfunctioning pipe, but our little drone's already working on it. So that's good. All good to go. And you, how much do you have? You'll have 45. So we can bring you over to here and we'll put down a little bit of a concrete deposit. Sure. That'll be good right there. And then we'll have you unload onto that. So all of our little dudes are going to grab it. And we'll need 35 additional concrete. And we'll need 10 polymer from this. Uh, depending on how much metal uh, they have. There'll be plenty of metal left in that thing. Okay. Now let's bring you back from over here. And we're going to grab uh, 10 polymer. So let's pick this up. And he's going to toodle himself all the way over. I hope. Toodly toodle toodle toodle. Here he comes. We have concrete next to this this dome too, which would be nice. I kind of wish that metal would have been next to the rare earth metal, but okay, hold on. I need 10 on you. Two more. One, two. Oh, we got 13. Okay, let's try to unload a couple. There you go. No, nine now. Okay, load up one. Boop. Oh, I missed it. Come on, grab one. One polymer. Got it. And now I need you to grab 35 more of this. Okay, let's grab from this one so we empty it. Just for the sake of emptying it. And then it'll load up on the rest of the capacity. Okay. Charging battery from the power grid. We'll be able to drive over here and it'll work out great. What do you have? What is that? Metals. Okay. There we go. So all of the concrete is in. The polymers are coming. And, oh, we needed 40. Hmm. Well, why don't you drop off that stuff? Yeah. Yeah, he's not driving around. Drop it off. There we go. He's unloading everything from his backpack. And our little drones are working nicely. Where are they putting it? Sometimes there's a little material hub that they put it on. Okay, he's got one. Okay, he's out now. What's it going to need? It's going to need a few more concrete, I think. Let's see. Let's just wait a second and see what happens. Oh, shoots. Just a couple short. Okay. 
that means I can grab a couple more. Hey! We got a new sector with a new anomaly. Perfect. I like these. It's like Christmas every time. He's going to go and analyze that one. That one's in that same general area, isn't it? Let's see that map. Okay. Three and four. We'll take those four. Very good. Our drill or our uh, thing he's coming up. Oh, yeah. All of the loot's in the middle. Look at that. Okay. So we need four more concrete off of you. How much do you have? You have five. That's perfect. And we'll unload. Well, we don't even need to unload it. Those little robots will work fast enough with it. Made it. Go, man. Drop it all off. Perfect. Okay, and now we're gonna make it. Here it comes. Our basic dome is gonna be built in a second. I love the I love the building process on this. Works it up from the bottom. I still don't know how you get uh, clear um, concrete, but whatever. <laughs> I don't I don't really care. It's still neat. Oh, and we can launch off our other rocket right now too. There we go. And a boink. Milestone yes. Achieved. New milestone. We have an <laughs> Shush. We have a water I know. We have a power yeah, shortage. please tell me. Anomaly what else do we have? Oh, thank you. Are you done There's telling me? To yeah, quit bank. talking. Okay, we can launch up this thing now. It is empty, isn't it? Ready for takeoff. I think it'll tell us. Uh oh. Takeoff in progress. Okay, there it goes. I Hopefully it didn't bring those prefab buildings that I put in it. I should have checked, maybe. Oh, though, we still have them. Okay, that's good. Very nice. All right. So we need our rare earth metal um, thing over here, and then we're going to start building up the, the basic things in this. So the rare earth metal right in here. We'll put it on right in that spot. Okay, these guys will go. It's going to take machine parts. Now we are going to need to build a drone hub over here as well, and, um, and we'll overlap these two. Okay, drone hub. Now let's see. Go away. Okay, that goes to about right there. So if I built one right in here, that would cover everything in the area. I like that idea. Let's do that. Sure, we'll build it right there. And that should work out. I don't know how they can do this. Uh, I don't know where the drone hub is stored. So maybe they'll just build it right away. Oh, they did. Okay, so it needs power. Do I have any power? I don't. And that other base has some, but not enough. So what I'll need to do next, um, I should move all my storage over so these two overlap, like in this area. So we could have a big storage facility right in here. We could also do, in the future, we can make another dome on this spot. But I'm going to put in my uh, storages. I'm going to make a few universal storages here. All right. We got some universal storage in. They should be able to move the things. If we increase the priority of these, our drones would start to use that. Oh, we can't increase the priority of those. Looks like they're going to do it anyway. Okay. I'll be able to move things around anyway. Uh, we are going to need to build power and our oxygen and stuff over. Uh, I don't like doing this too much because all of the things require, all of the wires and all of the pipes require um, maintenance. So we'll do the best we can with it. Let's get our power cables over. We'll just drive one. Okay. Hmm. All right. Kind of want to go up and over. Avoid that if I can. And we'll plug it into there. Okay. So that got all plugged in. We're going to need to power that up too, I bet. Power cables across. Okay. That'll be plugged up. Good. We do have metal. Wow, they're storing some things here. What is this? Fuel. All right. Makes sense. And our other spaceship just got home. Very good. Oh, that's such a mess. It is so ugly. My driving skills are not the best. Okay, let's get our um, life support. We'll get our pipes over to this. I'll have to bring in a pipe. And I'll bring it down there. We'll turn it over here. Okay. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. <laughs> Yay, another anomaly. All right. And then we'll plug it into here. And we'll plug it into here. Okay. Man, these things are all uh, life support tubes having problems. Another one. Where was that other? Did we have another anomaly? We did. Okay, how are you doing on power? Pretty good. Let's go explore this one. Where are you even at? Oh, you're up here already. Perfect. Yeah, okay, we got one, two, and three happening. This one's not probably going to have much of anything. Now, my wondering is on these wind turbines, they require machine parts for maintenance. Okay, so machine parts require metal, if I remember right. Ooh, we're going to build it all up. Perfect. Okay, these guys don't have much... Um, 
Hey, they don't have drones. Little drony face. Hey, these guys don't have power yet, so that's the problem. I could go get some metal, and then that would be better. You guys gonna go do it? Nope. I need to bring some metal over there. It's a good thing I got plenty of it. Let's load it up. Anomaly analyzed. Ooh, already. There's more to the barrier. Okay, open the research. What is that? Atomic accumulator physics. Stores electrical power. Oh, dirty. Sterling generator. We can build that now. All right. I haven't I haven't done much. Oh, we've been without... No, we still have the research going. That one's almost ready. Nice. We're finding some good stuff. Okay. Amplify increases production by 25%. Of what? But also increases... So, increases... Oh, production. Overall production. All right. That makes sense. Uh, we can get the sterling generator. I like these, but they're expensive. Uh, we might need some of those in the future. High capacity. It charges slowly. We could get those too. Uh, let's let's get in the biotech system here for a little while. We'll close that out. Ah, waste rock storage is full. So we need a new waste rock storage thing on here. Let's do that. Where is it? Uh, storage waste. Do a couple of those up here. That's good. I'm thinking about deleting these. Can I... How do you... If I delete them, what happens? Salvage. Hmm. I really don't know what happens to the storage if you delete it. Research complete. Milestone achieved. Oh, it just throws everything on the ground. Okay. Okay, research complete. We researched a breakthrough. Perfect. Close that up. Got some more funding. Printed electronics. What did this one do? Drone prefabs to be constructed in the drone assembler using metals instead of electronics. Okay, that's good. And then the constructed drone, available drone prefabs. So we'd have to build up the prefabs. Okay, no water, no power over here because we still don't have enough uh, stuff to make our pipes. So I'll bring you over and that should do it. it. Needs the metal for both of them. Okay, that'll work. This thing requires metal and machine parts too. I don't know, what's our machine part level at? What do we got? Machine part, 17 to 30. So we have quite a few left. That'll be something important to have in the future here. Okay. Aha! Power is online. Sector scanned. Oh, no resources in the new sector. I figured that one was gonna not have anything. Very good. Our power is in. They're gonna build up over here. What do we have? 18 of 20, 19 of 20, 20 of 20. Okay. Pipe leak reported. Another pipe leak. So we're gonna dump off, you know what? Let's dump it here. We'll dump all those metals off right in that spot. We have a water shortage. Yep, I figured that would happen. So the pipe leaks are very nasty. And then we'll come over and we'll grab up uh, machine parts. Hey, wait, can you pick them up? That'll work. Okay, and all of our extra guys should be bringing over um, the leftovers here. There it is. Okay, the machine parts are in. Can I tell you to grab all of this? Yeah. Are you full? Nope. You only do one at a time. Wow. Cable fault reported. Yeah, we're getting cable faults all over. Hopefully we can get uh, research for upgraded cables. Okay, that's full now. I'm gonna bring you over to here so we can get that going. Now our drones are online. Uh, there's plenty of stuff for them to do, and it is time now for us to start building up some things inside of our dome. What we want first is we want some living quarters, obviously. I'm going to do a, a double living quarter system. Uh, we can get apartments in the future, but right now we're just going to do double living quarters. And we can do dome services. Um, I liked putting a diner in, kind of a small building. We'll put you there, and then we could do like um, the food situation too. Is that in here? Nope. It'd be production maybe? Life support? Life support. Nope, go away. Hey, hop, let's come back. Life support. Hydroponic farm. Okay, so let's do two hydroponics. Hydroponic and hydroponic. Good. Cable domes without water. I know, it'll be okay. Where's our malfunctioning cable? Are we gonna get that fixed? Yes, he's going for it. Good. And we got lots of extra drones here. We have everything made out. So I'm just gonna drop everything off into this one. Unload all. Okay, the cable is being fixed up. Very good, little fella. You're doing you're doing the work. Dropping off extra things. And these guys are gonna be building like crazy in here. We need insufficient water, so we'll have to turn this other one on. I'll turn you back on. 
Wow. And then this, oh, it's got waste rock. Okay, we need to we need to get another waste rock storage. Uh, storages and dumping site. Okay, I got four storages. That should be good. Turning this guy back on. I think he's yep he's restoring it. It's back on. We got power. Uh, malfunctions. All good. Check it out. Our first little apartment has been created. A living quarters is online. I'm gonna buy up another rocket full of cargo, and I'm just gonna take electronics, machine parts, and polymers. Maybe some metals. We're gonna be running out of those pretty soon. Could get a few more of the drones too, so we can make some prefab out of those. We could grab a few of the other things like sterling generators. I don't really want to though. <clears throat> Maybe we'll grab one of each of these: a sterling generator and a vapor, vapor moisturizer. Now, one additional thing in this game, you do not have to max out your cargo capacity. Uh, you can save your money if you want to. And we have 380 million left, so this is going to be... We're going to go for it. Uh, let's let's drop these back a little bit and take some food. Wow. It's cheap. Food is cheap. We'll do three of these and we'll grab some food. Just to have it uh, when we need it. I like having those raw resources available. We have 0 of 14 residents right now. Uh, it makes sense, and the comfort of residence is pretty small. And we are going to get a few other things. We have current work available. Does it say? Yeah, vacant work slots is four because of that. And we can have 14 residents in here. So we'll get a few more of these things up uh, once we get the hydroponic farms going. Those are 12, I believe. Ready for your first colonist. Launch a passenger rocket. Thank you. Thank you, Hintbot. Your, your comments are great for me today. Now, the drones, yes, that is entirely included. Perfect. This is looking good. Vehicle battery low. Right. You? Okay. Can I just drive you up here and you'll charge off that power grid? Oh, you will. Perfect. Okay. How's my other robot doing? I'm going to bring you back down in here. Right down here. Traveling. Traveling robot man. Doing all the things that traveling robot man can. We'll bring you over. Okay, let's grab some more resources. Let's load up these. You gonna go get them? Okay, perfect. And we'll use you to, to load up. Okay, first hydroponic is online. Look at that. So this requires three botanists. We can ch choose a different plant that we want. Uh, good yield. We have wheat grass. Low yield, but grows very fast. Optimal harvest is two. One soul. Sector scanned. Okay, nothing cool there. Uh, optimal time. We have oxygen. A little oxygen production. That's kind of cool on all of these. We have a power oh, shortage. Great. Don't slow power. We'll fix that in a little bit. Uh, probably no wind right now. So we can do the leaf crops. We can do the microgreens. Low yield and slow grow, but require less water. Um, low yield, slow grow. Okay, low yield, high. We'll just stay with the, the microgreens. I'm not sure which would be the best. I'm sure somebody will figure it out in a little bit. Okay. Um, functioning cables. That should be fixed pretty soon. What I'm going to do next is I'm going to build up... Because I want... In, in this thing, I want to build up the production of um, machine parts. Because it has base production at 12, but it requires metals. We have metals right over here, so I can build up another another one and use it. I hope this works. Um, if not, we could just buy them. Uh, whatever. We're going to do... We're going to make some power up first. We're going to have a little power farm over on this side. And I want that right inside here. So let's build up a few of these. I want like four wind turbines, three and four, and then we're going to do the same with uh, large solar panels. Now you have to have a gap in between these because they're not smart enough to know how to connect them. One, two, three, and four. And we'll just drive together all of the... Oh, yes, the atomic accumulator in. Drive together this. And we'll bring you up, bring you back, and around. There. No problems with that. We'll have plenty of power. We'll do the atomic accumulator as soon as we can. Um, and we'll have lots of resources, so we'll just drop you down right here. All of the drones will be able to just take everything out and store it right on the surface. Ah, perfect. That looks good. No power dust in here. Storm oh, great. Dust storm. And a dust storm is the reason why you want we both solar panels and shortage. wind panels. And this is one reason why I wanted to get everything done right away. Uh, just so we can make sure our base is solid before we invite people. There we go. All the drones are coming in. I can build a few more of the prefabs now. 
Eh, thought I did that. Where's the research look like? Hmm. Okay, biotech. That's 3,000. I'm going to take it. And then we can start doing other things like low G hydrosynthesis. Okay, produces polymers for water and fuel. So that makes the fuel refinery. We're already okay with that. So we're kind of stuck. Uh, drone hub. So we can make the drone hub instead of buying the prefabs. And then the Explorer AI. For every RC Explorer map, we get um, we get 100 extra research per soul, which should be kind of nice. Uh, we could get that one. But Dust Storm has just arrived again. <laughs> Our poor little... Oh, can I close these? I need to close these. Oh, they're still closed. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we're all doing okay. I do like... I do like how <laughs> the dust storm only goes down below. Check that out. Look at that giant cliff we're on top of. How cool is that? We got all sorts. It's all gnarled up down there. Really, really neat. We can't get down there yet. We're going to have to make a tunnel. If I can figure out how to make the tunnel properly. Oh, we don't care about that. I want to get like this whole side and to get this top shelf done. So let's go down in here. Oh, there we go. Oh, no resources. That's too bad. Okay. Now, I want to try to build one of these things. I've never done it. Okay, so if I if I do this here, it says all clear. And then too far away. Oh, wow. Does that work? Too far from the drone commander. This sector is not yet scanned. This construction will possibly resource deposits. Yeah. So if I is that? Hmm. Close it. Okay, would they build that top one? No. I'm going to have to figure out how to build that one in the future. <laughs> not not today. Because uh, we can't, we don't need to go down there yet. I'd like to develop the top before we go down in. These guys are still taking all those resources out. That's what I love about having a, a couple resource uh, ships coming in. I could bring another one right now, but I don't think I have enough money. <laughs> I don't have, I got 1.8 mil. So that's not quite enough. That's why we need these rare earth metals. So we can start working on those. And now we do have this additional diner being made. We have work for these guys. There's three. And I switched it up so the different time shifts. So we don't use up our all of our water at the same time. So we have one during the day. And then one in the afternoon. And then like this one's going to have multiple. So you have four working here. We have three there. Seven. And then that's ten. And then there's like two that can go there. So that's our 14 from their first ship that can come in. So we, ooh, we could really get our first grouping in here. Would be really, really cool. Um, should we do that today? I think we could. Let's let this thing work first. And I want to get these up and running. And I'd also like to have our research done for this thing. And uh, it'll be pretty quick. Four turns be ten days on ten souls. Okay. Vaporators. Ooh, now I can look up here. Ah, soil adaptation. New building farm produces food. Oh, nice. We get the farm instead of the hydroponics. That's even better. I also wanted to get in... Um, this thing, the spire in here. We can build that up and that reclaims up to 70% of all of the water, but it does require a few extra workers. Oh, look at that. We already are at 28. Oh, uh, no. Vacant work slots, 14. And then we have 28 of those. Okay. So this takes a lot of concrete, obviously a lot of machine parts and polymers. Good thing I did buy a bunch of those. And our little worker bots are going crazy still. How are you doing? 34. It's almost filled up with uh, a good amount of supplies there. And is this thing working? What's going on over here? Why are they not doing this? Might not have enough drones working. Let's turn that up a little bit. They're both out of water. Should have the drones, right? The drone hub? They're in Ooh, is that one not in the drone hub? That one might not be. These should work. What are you going to do? Hmm. Okay, that one might be broken. We'll have to drive over our uh, our robot truck. RC Explorer, the rover. Drive you over here really quick. All aboard! <laughs> I love it. Everyone drives in, hops in, and then the old truck drives over. Awesome. So we do have our one RC drone hub over here, and it's doing well. These guys need to really be on top of this. I think that's the problem. We need a couple more drones. Ooh, we need to export that too. Yeah. I'm gonna pull all of that out and throw it in the... Oh, nice, it's healing up too, or powering up. Excellent. So I've got another big RC transport working on. I'm gonna bring him over here, Sectors unload. Oh, no new resource in that one. I wanna get this thing built up, uh, the water reclamation station. So we we'll just need a bunch of concrete on that. No resources from way up there, which you could imagine, because there's literally nothing up there. 
And we do have an... Oh, this would be a good spot. Uh, we could get both of those going at the same time. We have some more water and concrete. I think I just want to get this one going first. When you can drop or can launch this thing up. Perfect. What is that? Hmm. We can forbid exports. Good thing I don't have anything to export. What's that do? Automated mode. Okay. Launch. Don't need anything yet. We need some people, though. Are you going to launch? Yes. There you go. Okay, let's get this water reclamation station going. 10 of 50. Our little drones will work on it. How's our water over here doing? Okay, these things are good. Did you guys do the thing with that? Nope. Let's move you over here so you can remove these. I think we need some more drones just to do some better hauling. Those will haul into here. Can I move over? Doesn't look like it can. I might be able to move over far enough. No, they can't reach it yet. Okay. So they need to bring in the fuel down here, and then we'll have others bring the fuel to that. Okay, another system up. We got all of that happening. How's our research going on for our new nuke stations? Uh, a third of the way, maybe? Okay. And our accumulator. How's that look? Water reclamation, 10 and 13 of 50. Look at these little dudes. They go through the door. <laughs> Yoink. Little airlock. Zoop, zoop. Oh, I saw through. It's not a true airlock. I guess they don't care because there's not people. <laughs> Isn't that cool looking? This game is really pretty. I think there's others. If we click on this. Um, yeah, like here. Change the skin. So there's skins for them too. Look at that. Uh, and it's fully moddable. So there'll be plenty of modded skins you could use too. How's this look? Rotter Reclamation. As soon as that's good to go, I think we're going to bring in that uh, first people. It's a bit sad to say, but we're running low on uh, on metals. So these, what are these? These are polymers. We're going to have to find some metals to grab. Yeah, polymer deposit. Polymer deposit. We're going to have to go on a long adventure to find some, I guess. Uh, we might need to make it. Oh, we can't really afford another rocket. Well, we could. We can just spend everything. There's some right here. We'll just send that up. Give me you, RC Transport. Your battery is almost healed up. Powered up, sorry. Charged up, and we'll click on you. Wrong button. We'll click on you, there you go. So he'll go get that. We're gonna have some problems in a little bit uh, once we're out of metals. We're gonna have to get that thing running. Uh, okay, we'll do the best we can with it. So now, still not built in here. I don't like that skin, let's change that. I like the clear. Okay, and then this is almost there. What are you doing? What are you doing, drone man? <laughs> he, was, he was dancing. Yeah, there's that water reclamation station. Very close. Here's the last one. Our reclamation station is online. Oh, not quite. <laughs> oh, another sector. A little bit of money out of it. Is that million or just regular monies? I wonder. Can I tell? Where's the button to tell me how much money I have? Colony overview. Uh, that was million, I think. Or, yeah, there it goes. Up, up she goes. We got that spire going in. Beautiful. Spire is online now. Good. So how many people? We have 20 vacant work spots with uh, 28 residential slots. Okay. Let's get our first ship in. What we're going to need is uh, a few biologists and a couple people working in here and maybe some engineers. So let's grab that. Grab that ship. Passenger rocket. Age group, let's not have children and not have seniors. Youth are probably not the best either, so we can have adult and middle-aged. Let's go back. Uh, specialization, we do want some botanists. Let's take the three botanists, I guess. Three of seven. We want some engineers. Let's see. Uh, plus dining social. <laughs> That's true. Uh, I was an engineer for nine years before I did YouTube, so if you're wondering about that. Um, okay. Okay. They're worked in factories. We don't have the factories yet. We have scientists that are training. Uh, geologists. Let's see. Extractor buildings. We should have some of those. Okay, that should work. And then... Oh, we, we also had that one. Uh, like the... What was that one called? It was like the... Let's see. Workaholic. None of that. I thought we had one that was like a, a celebrity or something. Perks. I don't see it though. Yeah, celebrity. We'll take that celebrity. Great. So let's see. We have matching colonists 34, and we can launch. We could we could go deeper into it if we wanted to, uh, but we're just gonna launch, and it's gonna take a little bit of time. We'll get our people in here just in a little bit.
But I do think that is something good for us to do in the beginning of the next video. So guys, I hope you enjoyed our adventure into surviving Mars today. If you did, please do let me know down below in the comments section. Go ahead and check out the game on the Steam page as it comes out in about two weeks. And keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.